Yeah, come look at this. You, this is how corrupt it is. It is so corrupt. It is shocking. I mean, I've been here since January of 2021. Here we have Majorie Taylor Green coming out to tell us how corrupt the system is. Well, it has been going on like this for a very, very long time. They've actually passed a lot of bills like this when the people are actually distracted, when the people will do something about it are no more, or when the people who will do something about it are sleeping or are being distracted with a Christmas holiday because they've actually done it one time where the president actually signed something on a Christmas holiday that ought to be discussed by Congress but it wasn't, it was just passed because people were all distracted by a lot of things so nobody knew about it and when it was passed no one could actually argue about it anymore so this system is actually designed for them designed for them to get away with things like this they know what they are doing Although some people are also saying if it was the Republican side, Majority won't say anything about it. But it's still right that she actually came out to say something about it. This is what she. Hey everyone, this is Congresswoman Marjorie Taylor Greene. I want to tell you how corrupt Congress is. Now, you would not believe what happened last night. As a matter of fact, I'm still shocked about it. And the rest of the Republicans, we're all shocked about it. So you've been hearing probably about the omnibus bill that has been going through the Appropriations Committee. This is a $1.5 trillion omnibus bill that none of us got to see anything in the bill, in the bill text. We had no idea what was in it until this morning when we found out that the Rules Committee, which is a Democrat-controlled committee, and they, they put out their... Um, basically their alert on their website. They did not email any of us. They put it on their website after midnight, midnight as, as in early this morning, they put it on their website that the rules committee would be meeting at 1.30 a.m., 1.30 a.m. And that is where they, the rules committee meets to debate the bill. Now, normally in how Congress should work, but it doesn't work this way since Pelosi has been speaker, is an appropriations bill is something that every member of Congress can go, they, we can put amendments in, we can debate on the bill. And then once it goes to Rules Committee, that is where we can go and argue back and, and try to put amendments and try to make changes. So they met in the middle of the night, in the dark of night, the Democrat-run Rules Committee met at 1.30 in the morning. And by 2.30 a.m., 2.30 a.m., early this morning, they had passed the $1.5 trillion omnibus bill and they released the bill text. So for all of us here in Washington, when we woke up earlier this morning, we found out that it was too late to go in and try to put amendments in, try to argue back, try to get things removed from this horrendous, absolutely horrendous $1.5 trillion spending bill that's supposed to keep the government uh, the lights on. But no, we weren't able to do that because the Democrats snuck it through, literally snuck it through from 1.30 in the morning till 2.30 in the morning. They did not tell us ahead of time. No one had any idea until they put it on their website after midnight. After midnight, they posted it. So none of us knew. How were we supposed to know? This, supposed to know. This is not how Congress is supposed to work it's completely broken so when you look at our government and you you are shocked and cannot believe that the things that happen here in washington dc i am telling you this is how corrupt it is it is so corrupt it is shocking i mean i've been here since january of 2021 and i have been continuously my mind has been blown at how bad it is here in washington and how corrupt